to my mind, the keys to getting the most out of the play are an, a balance of um, exploring the characters uh, fully, because they're actually really interesting and sort of ruefully human <laughs> uh, people with uh, incredible precision, um, because uh, the kind of the bones of the play are the bones of farce, and farce only works if it's incredibly precise, and that just means uh, the staging the, and the pace uh, have to be crisp and incredibly specific and precise. So it's, 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 it's an actually a really interesting challenge and to, to get that balance of, of full character work and, and something, uh, on the other hand, at this, and at the same time, completely technical and precise. Yeah, the thing is, you, the thing about a farce is you have to, you, you have to, um, you have to be able to recognize, and this is what I meant by full character work, is you have to recognize the characters um, quickly, instantly. And you also have to, but you also have to, um, and, and I suppose the key to the, for the audience is that we, uh, as uh, when we rehearse, are spending a great deal of time staging it and timing it so that it's completely precise. And the, the thing for the audience is it ends up being seeming effortless and, uh, and breathtaking because all of these things are happening so quickly, um, simultaneously, um, and, and hopefully hilariously. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, it's, it's, there, on the one hand, it's a, a farce is a machine uh, that, that has to operate completely smoothly and, um, and without, any, you know, without any hitches or coughs or hiccups. And on the other, but on the other hand, it has to be. There has to be something human about it. Otherwise, we, you know, people won't watch it. It's just a. Uh, so. So that balance is that's t vital, and that's to me those are the, that's the key to making it work, and that key, for, and the key to having an audience enjoy it.